Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. My name is Cheryl. So today I'm going to show you how do I make my favorite snack, which is seaweed tempura. I'm going to show you guys how do I make this at home. It's super easy and it's so yummy. So if you guys are interested in how I make it, please keep watching. To make this seaweed snack, we need rice paper, seaweed, some water and some sesame seeds this is optional sometimes I actually don't use it because when I fry them all the sesame seeds come off so let's start so first we put the seaweed down and then wet this rice paper oops I broke it Is it here? Just press it. Try to cut some to match this missing bit. This is a bit of a mess. This rice paper, that's why I put the cream cream on the But I don't think they stick, that's a problem. When I fry them, they just tend to all come off. That's annoying, but it does make it look better though. So let's just try that again. The second one. This is like my favorite go to snack recently. I really enjoy this. So the same thing. Wet the rice paper and place it on top. Like so Like so Some sesame seeds on top Okay guys This is completely finished now And we're just going to wait for these to dry And probably around 3 hours minimum three hours they will be super hot and then we can fry them i know that it doesn't look too attractive but trust me these are super yummy and yeah let's just come back in a few hours i'll actually probably leave it overnight because i think it's easier by the way i want to mention that this rice paper you probably can get it in any supermarket or any Asian store. It's actually the same rice paper as the one to make Vietnamese roll. So now they're looking like this. So I've dried this overnight now. Um, now we can cut it. Trust me, these sesame seeds are gonna flip and fly everywhere. Okay, love it, flying everywhere, love it. That's why I don't know what's the point of putting these sesame seeds. But I did it. Um, yes, that's it. Um, we're gonna fry them now. So the oil is still heating up. I'm just letting it to heat up. So I also prepared this bowl and put this kitchen towel over it so it can soak up some oil. Okay, guys, so I think now the oil. It's hot enough. I'm going to put the seaweed in. I like to face the seaweed down and then push it down like this. That's what happens if you don't push it down. So 
So guys, this is how they look after I fry them and so what I like to do is I like to put some salt So I'll put everything here So I like to put some salt here And some salt here And yeah, that's it guys That's how I make my tempura snack Finished, so I'm going to try one. Listen, mm. it's such a good snack, especially when you are drinking or watching movies stuff like that is perfect for that so thank you so much for watching guys if you like today's video please give this video a thumbs up and subscribe to my channel leave a comment down below and let me know what do you think of this snack i'm going to put my instagram here and go and follow me there see you guys next time